The 91st Psalm is a timeless and cherished passage from the Bible that offers profound insights and promises of divine protection. In times of uncertainty, fear, and adversity, this powerful prayer provides solace, guidance, and protection. Through the verses of this psalm, we find a wellspring of strength, faith, and hope. As we turn to God in prayer, we will invoke the words of Psalm 91 to seek His shelter and refuge in the shadow of the Almighty. Brothers and sisters, now join me as we pray this powerful prayer together. Psalm 91 verse 1 says, He who dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. Heavenly Father, we come before you with hearts heavy with the burdens of this world, seeking the shelter of your presence, the secret place of the Most High. In our refuge, we find the eternal strength that carries us through the storms of life. We seek the shadow of the Almighty, a place where no harm can befall us. Verse 2 says, I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God in Him I will trust. Lord God, thank you that you are a safe place for us to go for help. We proclaim boldly that you are our refuge and our fortress, our unwavering protector. In the face of adversity, we trust in your unfailing love and divine guidance. In you, we find the ultimate source of strength and comfort, the sanctuary where our souls find rest. Verse 3. Surely he shall deliver you from the snare of the fowler and from the perilous pestilence. Almighty God, thank you for providing your word to safely guide my steps in troubled times, up steep hills, and through deep valleys. I ask that you shield me from the snares and traps that the world may set for me. Protect me from the unseen dangers that lurk in the shadows. Preserve my health and well-being in the face of perilous pestilence, for in you I place my faith and hope. Verse 4 says, He shall cover you with his feathers, and under his wings you shall take refuge. His truth shall be your shield and buckler. Loving Father, I praise you for your Father's heart for me. Thank you for wrapping me in your fierce and protective love your mighty wings drawn tight around me as the enemy rages against me. As a mother bird shelters her chicks beneath her wings, cover me with your protective love and care. Let your truth, a steadfast shield and buckler, be my constant companion, guiding me through the challenges that lie ahead. Verse 5. You shall not be afraid of the terror by night, nor of the arrow that flies by day. Divine Protector, you are the powerful Prince of Peace. Your unwavering faithfulness and sovereignty over heaven and earth eliminate the need for me to fear anything that may enter my life or the lives of my cherished ones. In the darkest of nights and the fiercest of days, grant me the courage to stand unafraid, knowing that your divine light and protection never waver. Father Lord, I ask that you shield me from the arrows of adversity, ensuring that I walk through life's battles with unwavering faith. Verse 6, Nor of the pestilence that walks in darkness, nor of the destruction that lays waste at noonday. O Lord, let me not fear the diseases and plagues that may assail me in the hidden recesses of life, nor the destruction that may strike at the heart of our existence. Lord, I trust in your unfailing protection, which extends both in the shadows of night and the broad daylight. Thank you for showing mercy to those who love you. Please open my eyes to see you at work in my life and help me trust you when life feels unfair. Verse 7. A thousand may fall at your side and ten thousand at your right hand, but it shall not come near you. Mighty God, I praise you as a God I can trust and under whose canopy of love I can rest. Though a thousand may stumble and tens of thousands may falter beside me, I take refuge in the assurance that you will not abandon me. 
Grant me the strength to persevere and walk steadfastly on the path of righteousness. Now we are going to read from verses 8 to 16 and pray afterward. Psalm 91 verses 8 to 16 say, No evil shall befall you, nor shall any plague come near your dwelling. Only with your eyes shall you look and see the reward of the wicked, because you have made the Lord, who is my refuge, even the Most High, your dwelling place. For he shall give his angels charge over you, to keep you in all your ways. In their hands they shall bear you up, lest you dash your foot against a stone. You shall tread upon the lion and the cobra, the young lion and the serpent you shall trample underfoot. Because he has set his love upon me, therefore, I will deliver him. I will set him on high, because he has known my name. He shall call upon me, and I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble. I will deliver him and honor him. With a long life I will satisfy him and show him my salvation. Righteous judge, I entrust to you the judgment of the wicked and the unjust. Let me not be consumed by anger or vengeance, but instead fix my gaze on your righteous ways, confident that justice shall prevail. Heavenly Father, by making you my dwelling place, I find an eternal home in your love and protection. In you, Lord, I establish my foundation, unshaken by the storms of life. Thank you, Lord, because through you, I have victory over every enemy that comes against me. No matter how strong my enemies are, you are still greater. In your presence, I find peace and safety. Father Lord, as I dwell in you, I declare that no evil shall befall me, nor shall any plague come near my home and loved ones. You are my sanctuary and my fortress. I acknowledge with gratitude the heavenly guardians you have set over me. You have provided your spirit, your word, and even angels as ministers of your love to protect me. Your love goes before me, stooping to remove even the tiniest pebble that could cause me to stumble. May your angels watch over me in all my ways, ensuring that I am protected and guided by your divine wisdom. Father Lord, as I journey through life's rocky paths, let your angels bear me up, preventing me from stumbling and falling. May I walk securely in your light and grace. With you as my shield, I tread boldly upon the dangers that would seek to harm me. As I face the lion and the cobra, I trample them underfoot, for you have given me the power to overcome all adversity. I set my love upon you, Lord, for you are the source of all love and goodness. In return, I beseech you to deliver me and set me on high, for I have known your name, and in your name I find salvation. Father God, as I call upon you, I trust in your promise to answer. Be with me in times of trouble, O Lord, and deliver me from every affliction, honoring me with your enduring presence and grace. In your loving care, I find the assurance of long life and the promise of your salvation. I thank you for the abundant blessings you bestow upon me. In Jesus' mighty name I pray. Amen. If you are blessed by this prayer type, thank you, Lord, in the comment section below. Dear friends, you can help us to reach more people with this powerful message and spread the gospel. You can do so by sharing this video with a friend or a family member who you know needs the blessing of this prayer and by clicking the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more videos that will bless your heart and uplift your spirit. Also feel free to leave your prayer request in the comment section so that we can take them to God in prayer for your blessings and victory. Dear believers, remember this, that God loves you so much and he will guide and protect you through the journey of life. May the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus be with you all. Amen.